Chess friends, how are you? Hope you are doing well and today I will show you an amazing chess game of today's world championship, Ding vs Nepo game 3, this is your today's puzzle, 90 IQ chess puzzle, solve it and comment me I will give you heart, let's go, Nepo started with d4, knight f6, c4 by Nepo Miyachi, in this position you have g6 called, dragon Sicilian, d6 e5 called puck defense, but it's a bad decision because white will gain big center space, so you can also play e6 c6, then d5. So Ding choose to play e6, knight c3, in this position, alpha 0's favorite opening is to play bishop b4, let me show you the opening, bishop b4 then queen here and d5 by black so we will take the pawn, pawn takes then bishop to f4 will come and that's it white have the open c file and bishop and the queen line up on there where black is pinned his knight on c3, Black will develop his pieces naturally and the game would continue like this but in your actual game. Ding played standard opening d5, this is the same variation as last day we seen, Ding played h3 last day but Nepo is not Ding he is a stockfish subscriber so he takes the pawn, pawn takes d5 and he will build his structure by playing c6 where white will struggling to play e3, making key pawn structure like this and so on, so we have bishop to g5, c6 by Ding, as I told you, white will play e3 making structure like this, black will push his queen side pawns to garb space. Where white will develop his pieces to have control over the center side, bishop here to controlling these squares, queen here to support him, so e3, h6, taking the knight on f6 isn't good let me show you why, there is queen takes bishop, and the queen will get a permanent good outpost on there, black will develop his pieces naturally, and he will get a chance to push his queen side pawns, queen g6 to pressuring white, so, back to the position, we have bishop h4, bishop here bishop to d3, keeping eye on there. Queen is coming on c2, we have castle queen c2 rook on e8, knight goes to e2, now these pawns are ready to push forward on their journey so knight on d7, we have castle, a5, in this position, Nepo have a great positional play with his bishop, let me show you the variation, there is bishop g3 to seize this diagonal, if you play any other move for example rook a7, then there is knight to b5, threatening the rook on a7, and bishop to c7 is coming, so you have to take the knight. Then there is bishop c7 and you will lose your queen, so back to the position, but Nepo played a3, his idea is to play f3 then e4, rook here to support this file, Ding played knight h5 to target this bishop, so after bishop takes queen takes bishop, rook to e1 and you might think why not Nepo played rook f e1, because the king rook is necessary to stay on there, to push forward his army, there is no need to put a queen side rook there, if you play any normal move for example, rook b8 threatening to play b5. Then he will back his knight. Let just play some more wasted moves for black, then f3 threatening to play e4 to break your ego, rook here then e4, takes and takes, knight here, try to fold the bishop's diagonal, then knight here and c5, e5, targeting to the knight and seizing the bishop's diagonal, so if you move back your knight, then bishop c4 will come, this bishop and rook sniper targeting on the king's structure, so after rook f8 we will see knight d5 to target this queen, queen moves back away, then the bishop will move back all the away, the knight is coming to the f4, so after b6, his idea is to play bishop here to target the knight, rook to f5 to target the knight, if you play g6 to protect the knight, then white will sacrifice his rook by capturing the knight, after pawn takes rook, knight to c7 to target the queen, queen on e7, then we will see queen g6 check, a killer move, pawn cannot take the queen because it's pinned to the king, so after king here queen check here, knight to f4 threatening to take the pawn then checkmate on g7 square, so queen g4 to protect it, rook to e3, threatening to make checkmate sequence like this, so you have to take the pawn on e5, giving back his material, pawn takes e5 and there is mate in few move, after bishop e6, try to cover this bishop's diagonal, knight to d5, threatening to play knight f6 checkmate, so you have to the knight with your bishop, bishop takes knight, then knight takes d5 will come, threatening knight f6 checkmate. How do you protect it? rook here, then knight check, queen takes and rook check, queen blocks and rook takes queen checkmate, because the pawn cannot take it, 
and every squares are covered by every body, game will be over, but this is more than 22 moves, strategical idea, which means an inferior human cannot analysis it, ha ha ha, and chess friends, if you want to become smart at chess then you can like and subscribe to my YouTube channel to get more episodes, back to the current position. Ding is egg in front me, so he played knight to f8, getting the diagonal and he want to put his knight on there, Ian moves back his knight, both players are moving back their knight but it's not necessary, anyway his idea is to play knight here, a4, to control over these squares with the nightmare, Ding moves back his knight, f3 and e4 is coming, so knight e6, Ding can play bishop here then push his queenside pawns, so knight e2, c5 bishop here rook here takes, takes and targeting to the pawn with a check so queen d2, bishop here and takes, we have some material exchanges, knight to d4, targeting the knight will not bring any advantages for black, there is takes takes and takes, white will get slightly advantages, and white have open e file that he will use it, so after knight here rook d1 and knight here, queen f1 rook c8, in this position we have knight a4, this position is totally equal, there is no secret advantages for any of side, queen backs and rook here. Queen here, targeting to this knight. And after some more moves later, we do see here repetitive moves, they made this game draw, however Ian is one point up against Ding, so wish you all the best thanks for watching subscribe for more bye bye take care see you soon.